boy? I wonder you can hear me. Is that your new tape? Star Lord. Who's the guy with the scary eyes? He doesn't have a name. He's one of the space riders. And he's not scary. He's cool. Your space rider certainly got his hands full. Pretty far out. Nobody says far out anymore, Ma. <laughs> Ma. What? Nobody says far out anymore. Oh, well, your mom there. Maybe we should see if we could get tickets to see them live. Really? Mm hmm Your mom may not look it, but I was quite the rocker when I was your age. Your father and I would just lie on the hood of my old Chevy and listen to Black Sabbath and... You like Black Sabbath? Like I said, your mom's cooler than you think. Oh, we'd look up at the stars and he'd... Tell me all about the places he'd been. Mom? How about some cake, huh? Yeah, I'll be up in a sec. You said that 15 minutes ago. If you don't hurry, I'm gonna eat that whole cake myself. No, you wouldn't. Yes, I would. <laughs> you wouldn't. Yes, I would. Hey, watch the hair. <laughs> We've talked about you leaving your toys on the floor. It's not a toy. It's an action figure. More like an action landmine. Stab your foot. I will. He doesn't even... Never mind. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec. I promise. Right. Oh man, I can't wait to play this. Maybe I can convince Annie to buy it with his paper out money. This will be worth hundreds of dollars someday. I gotta beat Janie's high score. This is embarrassing. Three natural ones in a row last game. Some barn I turned out to be. Traveling through space must be amazing. The final battle was awesome. Looked like the heroes were done for, but they pulled it off. I can't believe I caught this. That maiden show was awesome. I'd love to be able to ride one of those light cycles. Ooh. Might as well just peel the stickers off and put them in the right spot. Fingers are still crap from trying to bookmark pages. I know it's not how you're supposed to play, but I'm tired of dying everywhere. The movie was okay. The soundtrack really kicked butt. Keep hitting those dingers, George, and you'll make it in the Hall of Fame for sure. Need to build up my calluses. Pretty crazy that all that destruction started from one little mistake.
Holy crap, Drax. You gotta stop doing this, man. It's weird. We are approaching the quarantine zone. How long was I out for? 15,338 ticks. That's very specific. The betrayer is ready to begin her mission. She has requested your presence in the cockpit. Gamora's on our side, Drax. She is the spawn of my sworn enemy, a murderess and a traitor. I do not trust her. We'll try. We're supposed to be a team. So, Drax, excited to meet our buyer after we catch the monster? Of course. Lady Hellbender is a legendary warrior and a noble queen. And she's rich. 
That is not a prowess, simply a commercial fact. As long as she buys her monster, she doesn't need to be royalty. You are jealous of her status. No thanks! Being a queen means being born with a target on your back. Kind of like the one on yours. Oh. Almost 20 years, and those tracks are still fire. Rocket! Did you bring back the docking chips you took from the alignment console? I'll do it as soon as I reconfigure them! You better not try to sell them off! Not like I'd make any money! Things are so cheap they couldn't align two magnetized connectors. Wish you were here, Mom. You remember that dealer who asked about the emitters? After you left, he- Drax! <laughs> about Gamora. Can this not wait, Peter Quill? I am readying my body for battle. Uh, <laughs> you know we're supposed to capture this monster, right? Not kill it? Of course. But I suspect it will not go down without a fight. Cool it, muscles. Lady Hellbender ain't gonna buy damaged goods. I will aim to preserve the integrity of the beast as best I can. Good. What is it? Dude, take five. We gotta talk about that Gamora thing. She's waiting for you in the cockpit. I know, I know, I just meant... Are you gonna be okay? You two are gonna be alone on the ship for a while. Rest assured, Peter Quill. I will keep a watchful eye and thwart any attempt at treachery. Or... You could try trusting her. <laughs> you are naive, Peter Quill. She is a mistress of deceit. All good, buddy? I am Groot. You know, I don't understand you, Groot, but I'm gonna assume you just said something super kind and thoughtful. <laughs> I am Groot. What did the tree say? No idea. Good old Milano. Engine parts from at least five different black markets. Hmm. This moment of quiet reminds me of the legendary siege of Seknoff 7. Oh, not again. It is said that Lady Hellbender held her breath through ten moons while riding across the stars on the back of a great horned beast. And when she when arrived... When she arrived, she exhaled, and the wind blew away the Shatari. Indeed, it did. If he realized it didn't make no sense, he wouldn't be telling it. Groot really needs to get these plants under control. She's only been here a few months, but her room's already decked out. Wonder if Drax was allowed to decorate his cell in the kiln. Probably not. Not so sure about tooth cleaning tablets. Manual brushing is where it's at. Gamora? Up here, Peter. Hey, that's my chair. Oh, then why aren't you in it? I was, uh, strategizing. It's one thing to get into the zone, but we still gotta catch that monster. Right. So did I miss anything? Other than a ton of suspicious glares from Drax, not really. Now, if you're done 
strategizing. Feel free to grab your seat. We're almost ready to go. Okay, here we go. Rocket crew, Drax, get in here. We're going in. We still have a few ticks before the next time window, actually. The next one? Nova Corps security gear resets every rotation. We want to be in and out before our code expires, or we'll get stranded. As we wait for the next reset, we'll get a full rotation to do this. Nice. <laughs> oh, why is the Novanet still up? Thought we were going in. Well, it appears the assassin's contacts are as untrustworthy as the betrayer herself. Oh, please don't tell me Gamora's backdoor codes are bust. We nearly went broke getting them. Relax, Rocket. We still got a few ticks before the next time window. The network just reset. You can enter the sequence, Peter. 0451. That's it? Four digits? Suspicious. These security measures are too simplistic for Novacore. It's not that simple. The code only works on this date for this ship. Oh, I get it. Gamora's codes are more like an encryption key of some sort, designed to integrate temporal co- There. wasn't very popular in the Shatari army, especially with Thanos in charge. Yeah, it's probably all harmless now. I mean, Novacore had 12 years to get rid of the heavy-duty explosives, right? <laughs> That's why I like you, Quill. You're so pure. Oh, the wonderful and terrible things I could do with all this tech. Stay focused, Rodent. We do not come here to scavenge. Why not? The Milano's weapon systems could use an overall. Plus, there's good money in it. The piece that we seek is far more valuable to the Monster Queen of Seknoth 9 than any illegally acquired salvage. Whoa! Oh, place is really shifty. I'm not seeing a monster, but that big cylinder up ahead looks like mining ship Peter's friend said to look for. <coughs> friend? For a night? And you'll see the monster as soon as we place Rocket's monster summoning thingies. Flark, yeah. Group Quell Soda. Team Rockets up first. I still do not understand why I must remain on board with the Assassin. Oh, because you're part of Green Team. You assigned me to the team before you named it. My skin is not green. It's teal. Teal? What? Listen, if we want to trick the monster into going inside that mining rig, we need to place thumpers on both sides. Two sides, two teams. And two clicks to the drop site. Ground's too unstable to land the ship. You'll need to jump. That's our cue. Let's go, group. <laughs> Don't worry. Once the thumpers are placed, we'll meet in the middle and we'll capture the monster together. Very well. My baby. It's a ship, Peter, not a child. Huh. Oh, can you imagine? What? The pink coup? It's custom nano rest, designed to keep all this war stuff from floating away. Visor works. Sure, it works. I checked it right before we left. Did you just put checked it in quotes? What? Nah, it's totally safe. Now, can we please focus less on the toxic goo and more on all this cool war junk it's holding together? I didn't mean toxic, toxic. More, uh, don't put it in your mouth, toxic. Hey! Starboard! Wrong way! You guys sure you don't need help? I am good. Yep, very sure. Focus on your own task. 
Yep. Being here definitely feels a little weird. Yo, Quill! These coordinates are so reliable. How come we're the only ones out here trying to catch this thing? We're the only ones crazy enough! Thinking that big cylinder thing is our rendezvous? Yeah, that's the mining rig. So weird seeing it all clustered together like this. Bits and pieces of a war that span the entire galaxy held together by pink goo. Ebrium based nano resin. Whatever. I'm just saying it's a lot to take in. <laughs> oh, look! Yellow and blue! Looks like an old Novacore frig. Nice! Come on, dude. People probably died on that ship. Killjoy, why'd he even bring us here if the place is so sacred? I can name at least a dozen planets with monsters on them, so... Flat broke, Rocket. We need a big break. Aren't you tired of eating Yarrow Root? It's so... mealy. Listen, this is a restricted zone. Whatever monster lives here, nobody else has one. Lady Hellbender values rarity in her acquisitions. Exactly. You know, I think I do sort of get it. Thousands of worlds fighting for some fleeting greater good. Guess it is kind of poetic. I am good. Ah, cheer up. Just because the war was horrible doesn't- Whoa! Okay. I'm okay! Ha! <laughs> Almost made yourself a very late war casualty. Not funny. You know, I like this. This is fun. The three of us, hanging out, just like when we started this gig, before you-know-who joined us. I do not hate everybody. I tolerate Quill. Quill's a, a swell guy. I hope you get that promotion, Rocket. <laughs> the three of us have had some good times. Careful on that thing, Quill. You spot something out there? There's the mining rig. Any sign of our monster? Not yet. Peter Quill, the insubordination of the assassin has become insufferable. I'm doing exactly what we planned to do. She is also quite contrarian. We talked about this on the Milano, Drax. Whoa! Pretty sure that way's a dead end. You sure? Ah, there we go. Path's this way. Come on. How can you even tell? Just trust me, all right? Hey, Groot, you think we could find pieces of the Tryon Shard in here? I'm Groot. You never heard of the Tryon Shard? A pyramid of pure evil that corrupts everything it comes in contact with. I'm Making things up. Name one time I ever made something up. I'm Groot. I'm Groot. I am Groot. Ah, uh, shut up. Ask Gamora. Bet she's heard about the Tryon Shard. Hey, Gamora! Ah, uh, shut up. Ask Gamora. Bet she's heard about the Tryon Shard. Hey, Gamora! I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, come on. I know Thanos had his hands on it during the war. It's gotta be in here somewhere. Quill, tell- Ah, oh, where's Quill? What the hell is he still doing back there? How'd you even know the other way was a dead end? Because, unlike you, I have a very keen sense of direction. 